the most obvious thing that you do all have with you that you can use when you go hunting is your mobile phone. Like in hospitals, so some hospitals they say turn them off, turn your phone off, because it can affect the equipment. But usually, as I say here, they're always flickering a little bit unless you go like that. <laughs> and if you want to sit like that for the rest of the evening, that's entirely up to you. But that usually, no, that one hasn't down there, has it? No, it's quiet tonight. No, but she's got three. Three lights up there. Oh right, yeah, it's the EMF. Thing. It's probably the EMF coming up. So anyway, so other things that we can do is to say your mobile phone. You've got the torch. You've got your camera. You have got your voice recorder. Now that's a good idea because you can put a voice recorder on, ask the spirit a question, again with the rods, crystals, glasses, everything. Give the spirit a chance to answer back. You know, not on your mail, come on, go. You can't tell you how old it is anyway. It has to be a yes or no answer unless we start using a Ouija board. We don't usually use Ouija boards as an event company because one of you 